Well, how cool is this? This morning, a group of fifth graders at Thousand Oaks Elementary School are getting a special visit from Sarah Spivey and David Sears. They're already having fun. So <laughs> it's time for a new edition of Science with Sarah. So let's hand it over to them. Good morning, guys. Hey, good morning. Today is going to be a fun day. Still trying to figure out if I'm smarter than a fifth grader. I think, let's see, I think they're pretty <laughs> smart, David. They're so. smart. They're like sixth, seventh, eighth grade level. I know. Because we've been talking to them. They're pretty smart. And yeah, you're right. just a little higher than that, huh? I'm just messing with him, okay. Hey, so today we're gonna be making hovercrafts out of balloons and like old CDs. So this is Sarah's mix CD. I've got some Backstreet Boys and some uh, sync on there from my heyday. Okay, so here's what you need. You need an old CD or an old DVD. Backstreet Boys. I want it the, okay. like this okay? Yeah, okay and you're gonna hot we'll glue it yeah exactly right. you're gonna keep it closed david keep it closed. and you're gonna hot glue it I'm onto the sure cd it okay. yeah there you go hot, hot glue it fun. onto the cd so this i like to do fun. a little layer right here first. watch your fingers this yeah i don't want to get burned hot glue with hot you guys are awesome that was a great singing uh, y'all know any george straight any george straight any george straight yeah Oh, come on. Okay, uh, so you're going to hot glue it and then you're going to do another gotta, layer gotta around to, there. I got to wait for it to cool down. So this is what it okay, cool down. This is what it's eventually going to look like. Right. So you want to get, get a layer around there too. All right, at home. Now, make sure your parents are around when you're hot gluing. Yeah. Like, it, it's hot. I may or may not have burned my little fangy. Oh, so that's not good. Okay, so All then right, what you're going to do is you're going to blow up a balloon. This oh, is going to be your part. source of air. We're learning about renewable resources, wind, solar. This is going to represent wind. Good job. I'll do it too. As big as you can. I've been known to have hot air. We know that. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're not going to tie it, but you are going to twist it. Twist it. Okay, the reason why you're going to twist it is because you want to put it over here and you don't want the air to go out. And make sure your pop top is closed. Now, once it's twisted, you can untwist it. Oh, I didn't decorate mine. Hold on. Oh, sorry, David. All right, here, let's do this. this. What is that? It's That's going a... to be a double T. That's a great decoration, Texas I guess. Tech. Oh, Texas Tech. Okay, okay well, right. get Maggie. All right, so now your hovercraft is ready right, to go. So you just, it's kind of like air hockey. So you're going to pop the top open, and then you're going to let it slide. And you can see how it floats on a cushion of air there. And you can even do bumper hovercrafts. You ready, David? Oh, Boom! Oh, oh, oh. Hey! <laughs> All right. So this is a great example of how this is powered by air. The air also um, offsets the friction, and that's why it floats like that. So it's a cool experiment if you've got some extra CDs lying around. Are you guys ready to do this experiment? Okay. After the commercial break, these fifth graders are going to let their hovercrafts fly. We're at Thousand Oaks Elementary and we have made balloon hovercrafts for Science with Sarah. You guys ready? Let it, let, pop your top open. Pop the top. And there you go. Wow. Whoa. Ah, get out of here. Whoa. It's, so that's so cool. All right. Did it come out the way you thought it would? Oh, uh, yeah. Yes. Wait, uh, what did you think it was going to happen? Uh, uh, it was going to float a lot, but it didn't really. It ran out of air, right? It ran out of its it has resource. To have the air in there for it to hover. Mm -hmm. You can blow it up again so and do it again if you, you want. Blow it up again. So the, the more air you have, how long did you think it was going to last? Um, actually, I had no idea. I just thought it was going to fly or somewhere. I it, it, that was going to stay. It sort of flew. It, it flew on the, the ground. ground. Okay, you guys around. ready? All right. Pop open your top. All right. How long did y'all think yours was going to last? I there, you go, there you go, William. There you go, William. Five seconds. Like five. Four, about that long. three. Two, one. Ah, oh, you were right oh. on. Five William, right how five. long did it last for, William? Ten, Ten seconds. That's pretty good. Okay, you guys ready? Yeah. Pop your top. Ready, set, go. Okay, I'm going over here. Hold on. I can't Whoa. Oh, yeah. Awesome. Oh, my God. Looks great. How long do you think 
Facebook. What do you up. think? I thought it last five minutes, but it didn't last. It didn't five last five minutes. It did not last. Oh, last five oh, oh no! Now you got four, Sharpie five, all over your hands. Four point yeah. six. Okay, are you guys ready? Four point six two four seconds. Yeah, I know. Probably yes. kind of close. Can we do this? This is the, this is the young guy with the tie. I don't He's a scientist. Know. Okay, ready, set, go. By the way, okay, wait, 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 wait. Here we go. Hey, hi, Okay, y'all. Okay. Y'all gone? Okay, here we go. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. Blast off. Listen to the sound of renewable energy. Get off. Woo. Oh, man. Yay. So what made it go? Um, All the air that was compressed into the balloon. And how long did you think yours was going to go? I thought it was going to go uh, 30 seconds, but it went 10 seconds. It went 10 Interesting. seconds? Interesting. Which means you need more air. So what's great about renewable energy is you guys can do it again. So go ahead and blow up your balloon again. Oh, Are three, you ready? Two, one. Go. Go. <laughs> well, yours is lasting longer. Why? Because it has more air in it. Because it has more air in it. Exactly. So is there more friction or less friction when the air goes through the, the cap? Um, I think there is like more friction to the cap. Well, the air offsets the yeah. friction. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Okay. Okay, table over here. You guys ready? Three, two, one. Pop your top open there. Pop this one open. Whoa, that looks like UTSA colors. Like this. Whoa. Wow, that's a good one. That's Roadrunner scoring right there. Touchdown. Like you, you can do yours, okay? Three, two, one, go. I can't it. It's so wide around. Whoa. Your balloon is so long. Did you fun? think it was going to work? Yeah. Like I liked um, it a lot. I liked it. Yeah. I thought it was going to last for 10 seconds, but it lasted for like five. It lasted for about five. Okay, like last five table. What's your name? Sophia. Sophia, are you guys ready? Yeah. Okay, three, two, one, go. Whoa, yours even got a little air. That's cool. You went all the way to the edge with your balloon blowing it up, didn't you? Yep. You couldn't put much more air in there. Yep. Yours actually went longer than five seconds. So we got about five, six second balloons. Okay, everybody, I want you to blow up your balloons, and on the count of three, we're going to let them go into the air. This is not necessarily.